is for, for a longer overnight parking for motor homes and camper vans. This uh, is daytime, take your kids on the beach for a few hours. Right. That's a wee bit more confusing. Yeah, it is confusing, but I, at the end of the day, I would go for that one. So you reckon go for that one, not that one? But I want yeah. to stay overnight. What, 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 are you, what are you going to do, 11 quid? Yeah, I want to yeah. do the overnighter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm looking to stay overnight, it says 11, it's 24 hours. In that case, if you want to do that, that's, so that's that, that one there then, you reckon? You're yeah. Go for, for um, the afternoon bring, bring and go app. Yeah. Yeah, if you were going to, um, if you were just going to stay here for the afternoon and then go somewhere else for the night, then, then it'll, it'll be, be that one. one, but that's the over, that's the yeah. one. Yeah, so we're just down on uh, this Exmouth seafront at the moment and we're, um, we've got the guys here that are trying to sort us out. Uh, there's another guy there that's just uh, paid on the app and I'm going to move up and we're going to try and get in a better position where I can get my nose in off the pavement. This is looking pretty good down here. If we can pull this off, this is looking quite sweet. Uh, oh, there you go, look. So, um, what's, I don't know, I've lost track of time, but the worst part about coming down here was literally trying to sort this app out and uh, getting parked up legally but now we're kind of just into it now we're parked up and we've just bumped into some incredible guys from Burnham on sea in this little swift uh, escape next door and uh, now oh ps my um yeah my uh, my selfie stick is um so it's going to look a, probably a little bit different this week it's not going to be so far away but uh, my selfie stick i'm waiting for the little bracket underneath but that's another story having a beer <laughs> it's motorhome life down at Exmouth Seafront and uh, we've just what yes yeah, so we parked up um, what we paid 11 pounds on the parking app 24 hour period hit the button the stop clock starts ticking away so we are here to well probably we'll be gone for breakfast in the morning at some point but um, there you go
bumped into a guy next door to us, our next door neighbour, and he's got this super long, is it a lime? Lime? Is it lime? I've got my sunglasses. Yeah, like yeah it's lime. It's definitely lime. I've just lifted them up. And he's got this super lime VW next door to us, and he's got the lime seats. Look, check it out. He's living the dream. I'm just check out the view from his window as well, straight along Exmouth Beach. Absolutely living the dream. I'm gonna come around the back a little bit. Come around the back. Look, there we go. Look at that. Look. So uh, yeah, that, that is like mental. I'll check it out the car. It just like stands right out, doesn't it? Awesome. Look at this view tonight. Look at this sky. He's going to be sleeping up. Are you sleeping up there? No. No, where are you sleep? Oh, on a rock and roll bed. He's sleeping. He, it could be a bit thundery tonight, so he's he's playing safe. And he um, he's literally sleeping on the rock and roll bed just in case there's a thunderstorm. No, he's, <laughs> he normally sleeps there. There. He's <laughs> but uh, oh, mate, look at this. Like it's like uh, epic bo backdrop tonight. But this bloody sky, like, it's just looking awesome. Absolutely living the dream, though. <laughs> we get him going. Just such a nice backdrop today, though. van life this is motor own life in Exmouth so they're just washing down washing down that lovely <laughs> look at that out the window look at that that's van life <laughs> living the dream right. the Exmouth usually misses it, it goes we're, with, we're literally still, right. still down here on the seafront of Exmouth <laughs> and uh, we, we've, 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 we've got our friends from the uh, enforcement um, officers have just come up again having a chat and uh, and basically these guys are like doing they're, they're doing their job they're enforcing the um, um, restrictions and stuff along the front here and uh, but hey we paid our money and uh, <laughs> last night Job. Yeah. We have, so, have so, job. Yeah, we so we're, we're still here with the uh, parking enforcement people and she was just telling us that she literally does this job for the love of it honestly and she <laughs> but what an incredible what an incredible place what an incredible place to um to have a job to have a job it is incredible right should i give you a ticket now or later then <laughs> i'd be in trouble Depends whether your actions are more than preparatory to drive. Oh, really? Because you're you're okay. not necessarily. As long as you've got the keys of the car in your pocket, yeah. and, then, and you're over the prescribed alcohol limit, then technically you're drunk in charge of the vehicle. But, yeah, of the vehicle. But in order to actually get that through a court and get a charging decision from CPS, you have to be doing actions that are more than merely preparatory to drive. Yeah. So if it's obvious that you've decided to park in a lay-by so that you can have a few beers and drive when you're safe the next morning, that isn't going to be a prosecution that will get through because you're clearly trying to do the right thing. Because that's what worries me about this, because I've got my motor home there now and I think I've got the keys in my pocket. Yeah, the keys... The, it worries me that, that I have never, to lock it. They'll never get past CPS. No, um, I know they're like, I know so, they're tough. I know yeah, they're tough. Yeah, so hang the keys up on the pegboard in your van. Yes. Yeah. Um, and you know, you, yeah. Well, you, when, I do, you when I do, when I go in, it'll be safer. <laughs> loving it. <laughs> loving actually, it. Yeah, actually, I was about that. actually, 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 a lot of van lifers. Like, you've just said something. That she can only drive an automatic. There you are. Yeah. So that's it. So now I can. Yeah. 
so <laughs> you've, <laughs> you've got a mobile house. <laughs> the, 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 de the debate goes on, but that, that's incredible. That just got some incredible information off this guy. So, uh, Exmouth. There we are. Oh, look at that. Nightmare. But we are s You need to hang with us a little bit. Yeah, yeah, more. definitely, I need definitely. To get up. <laughs> get some bags on the back. The fourth thing. <laughs> So this very coin gentleman has just let uh, Jake into his Mustang, just give him a, give him a bit of a rip roll on the throttle. And uh, that is absolutely incredible. Jake is loving it. Absolutely incredible. Check out this incredible dashboard. Uh, yes. Got a drink. Oh Carry. my God, where, where the hell are we? What the hell? Drinking buddy. Oh my God. It's going to be a bloody rough it's, night. It's going to be a bit of a pool party, I think, tonight. It's, 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 it is. It is. So, so we get a little bit of rain in Exmouth, and uh, so we get the umbrellas out, you know? So you look at the backdrop here, look. you know, we're talking about van life, and blue skies, a little bit of rain, you know, don't put it off, just bloody, look, it's, the, weather the, rain. the weather forecast was not looking that brilliant, nope. but mate, it's 22 degrees, you know? And uh, look at this, line. this is absolute backdrop van life. Well, I built this near myself in a week. Jesus. I'll open the back doors as well, look. Here we go. Right. Here it comes. Oh, yeah. All right. right, we'll just come around the back end. Right, look at this. Mate, you've done an incredible job. Yeah, All I the... built this in a week because he wanted to go away. Bloody hell, so fair I play to you. I bought the van and I said, right, stuff out, I'm going to build it. So I built it in a week. Worked hard on it, late nights, early mornings. But good job, mate. Got it done. How long are you staying here? Only a couple of days. <laughs> yeah, we'll get some VT. YouTube, so, oh, so, so what are you called then? My name's AJ. AJ. Right. Husband. Okay, well you, know, you don't need to tell us your whole name, just like a nickname or something, you know, like. <laughs> so you're the, and, and he's living a van life in the back of his, like, well, in, in his um, van down here, like, Exmouth feet, he's loving it. And uh, he's a young lad, living a van life, Exmouth, and, um, yeah. He That's loves fun. us, he gets me out. He goes, he got his bike. Yeah, I'm the one, I'm board. the one that gets usually him out before he even asks me about going. So I'm like, Dad, let's go. We're going down to Exmouth. That's why I put... So we, we started off today like contemplating like coming down today and uh, mate have we had a rip roll. Oh wow. my fucking god! This is awesome. <laughs> That's like an aqua mug. This is camper life. Is that an aqua mug? It can swim. Yeah? A yeah. What? It can swim. But so it's like a, like the aqua mug. Wow. Yeah, so I know the Mercedes aqua mug. <laughs> Check these guys out, guys. We've, we've just. You've got to get into it because the 
the kayaks on top. Yeah, but <laughs> oh, okay. I was going to put some. Yeah, man, he's got a yeah, good jump on board, have a look at the roof, you can see it. Right, okay, we're, we're just checking these guys out. They're just uh, having their little uh, uh, little meal down here at uh, Exmouth Beach, <laughs> and uh, they're living the dream. We've literally come to a quick decision and we're going to walk on because the recommendations for the next chippy are going to be like super good. So hopefully it's not going to be that far. We'll, sh we'll check it out in a minute. So that, that's our um, dilemma at the moment. So we got the kid at Krispies and um, we're going to go crack on to the second one, which is supposed to be better. Hopefully it's going to be good. So it's looking like the proper fish and chip shop. This is looking amazing. Hopefully... Ten past eight on Sunday morning. <laughs> Good morning. So uh, yeah, I just got out of bed. I've had my cornflakes. I've had a cup of coffee, and uh, I just thought I'd take a little walk around, show you guys. And uh, I'm going to look up here, at and uh, basically you can see the um, all the motor homes all right up there. And what an incredible park up! So we played uh, we paid eleven pounds. Yeah, if you've seen it earlier in the video, but uh, eleven quid to say here, it's just like pretty nice. 
pretty nice. We had a nice, comfortable night. Lot of, not a lot of traffic going by. And um, what an awesome location. There you go, Exmouth Seafront, not bad. Exmouth Lifeboat Station on the end there. And uh, there's people in the water swimming. I'm just gonna, gonna come out over by the, by the front. Yeah, it's been a steady stream of like cars just pulling up, pull up, and they're, um, she's just getting her little board. They, they put these um, little floaty things. So there's some people out there, right out there, swimming with their floaty boy things on so they can be spotted in the water. So yeah, been a nice little steady stream of people just coming down having a having a swim. Looking pretty nice this morning. Up the coast, I think the sun's just starting to come through up there with a bit of luck. We've been so lucky with the weather again. So lucky with the weather. <laughs>